Welcome back legends. I'm now gonna talk about my routine when a wicket falls and how I go about getting into the middle and what I'm thinking about and what I'm focusing on. So as a wicket falls, first thing I do is I get my helmet on. Now I'm always trying to get out to the middle quickly. I want the opposition to know that I mean business. There's nothing better than when you're a fielder seeing a player walk out to bat who doesn't look like they want to be there. I want to show them that I want to be there. So I get my helmet on, I get it set, then grab my gloves and I usually start to stand up at this point, get the gloves on, get my wristbands out of the way, left glove on first. And at this point, I'm, I might still be having a conversation with someone. I might still be nice and relaxed. And then I'm trying to get out there as quickly as I can. So, obviously we're, we don't know where they are, but I'm really now starting to switch on. I like to look up at the sun and get my eyes adjusted. And as I step over the boundary, here's the boundary, I like to hit, do three, one, two, three drives. Swing my arms around. I'm just trying to get myself loose and starting to switch on. Obviously, I'm looking at the wicket. I'm seeing the opposition. They're probably all in a huddle at this point. Halfway out, I like to squat, bend down, get my legs working, and then really kick my bum and start to really get out here. I'm always walking out to the middle with purpose. I'm taking deep breaths. Really starting to really switch on it and get be nice and calm. Nice and calm as I approach the wicket. Okay, once I get to the middle, first thing I generally do is ask the umpire for centre. Okay, ask for centre, then mark my guard. I'm not gonna do it today, this is a fresh wicket about to play on tomorrow. Once I've marked my guard, again, I'm always trying to pro sort of project my voice. I'm trying to speak loudly. I want the opposition to know that I'm here. So when I say ask for center, I say center please, mark it, and then I'm always trying to have strong body language. I'm trying to show the opposition I want to be here. As I'm doing it, I'm really just trying to be calm and have positive thoughts. I'm ready, come on, I'm ready. Whatever happens, happens. And then I might do some guarding, check the wicket, find out how many balls are left. If needed, I might need to move the sight screen, but looking around at the field, and this is where I'm really starting to switch on. That whole time up until now has led up to what I'm doing, and I'm about to face the first ball. That's the most important time, is when I get back in here, and I'm facing the first ball. Once I'm in here, this is where it really starts. My mental routine really starts. I start to wiggle my toes, get myself ready, and I'm saying, game on. Game on, win this ball, win this ball. Game on switches me on, and then win this ball to, makes it a contest. It reminds me it's a contest, one ball at a time. I'm not thinking anything technical. I'm just trying to be in the contest. I'm just trying to win this ball. I'm trying to tap quite hard and then have a real presence and be positive. Come on, come on. In between balls, if I get through my first ball, deep breath again, might walk away. Again, looking around the field, maybe a little stretch, maybe a few more sort of side to sides just to get myself going, a few shadow bats but it's all about just getting into the moment, getting my mind into the moment, into the contest, having strong body language, and really being positive in my thoughts. I'm ready, I'm playing well, I wanna be here. Not letting the fear of maybe getting out, the fear of failure overcome me, but just really trying to be positive and trying to look to score. Whether it's my first ball or my 50th ball, I'm always looking to score. If I get a half volley first ball, I'm gonna be hitting it. I'm looking for balls in my area, looking for balls in my zone. I'm not just trying to survive. If I just try and survive, my feet won't move. I won't be getting into good positions and making good decisions. I really want to look to score because that's going to help me with my defense. It's going to help me in my leaving. It's going to help me with my decision making. So that is, guys, a snapshot or insight into my preparation or my routine as I come out to bat. From the time I, the wicket falls to when I get out here, it's all about staying calm, staying relaxed, trying to get myself up for the contest and ready. And then it's all about having a presence, really 
strong body language, sticking my chest out, and then getting myself ready for the moment the bowler is running in. Everything else before that's just preparation. Then the moment the bowler runs in, it's all about having a clear mind and being positive. So guys, I hope you've enjoyed that insight.